Hey, what's up guys? Your boy is Pilot 2K7 and we are back for brand new Grand Theft Auto 5 real life mod video. We're back at our tow company, Ace Towing and Recovery, and we're going to be doing a interesting tow today, guys. So, CHP just called us out. Uh, we have to head down to Sonora Freeway to tow a Silverado limo. Yeah, I never saw one of those before either, but we got to go grab this Silverado limo. Should be pretty interesting to make it even crazier. It's currently on the back of one of our competitors uh, flatbed trucks. So apparently they tried to tow a limo with a rolled back flatbed and they got pulled over by CHP. And uh, yeah, it's pretty much a DLT violation. So let's go check it out and see exactly what is going on. We are going to bring out our Freightliner today. This should be the perfect size truck for what we have to accomplish. And we should just be able to like uh, rear tow it and we should be good to go. So let's hop in and head towards the scene. Alright, got the truck turned on. I'll show you guys the light package. This one does run red and blue emergency lights as well as our regular amber lights, which is pretty cool. And all of the mods that I am using today will be linked down below in the video description if you guys are interested in checking it out. Um, definitely do so. Do keep in mind these mods only work on the PC version of Grand Theft Auto 5. And I also do have some tutorials as well on my website, acepilot2k7.com slash tutorial. So definitely check that out. Alright guys, so let's head out. We're going to leave the yard and uh, yeah, let's head towards the freeway. Now let me see which way GPS uh, wants me to go here. So it's going to be southbound. It's, I believe it's like right over here. It's pretty close actually. Alright, so you only have 1.57 miles away. It wants us to go this way. And let's head out guys. But yeah, how are you guys doing? It's a brand new week. Hope you guys are having a great day. Hope you are enjoying your summer. Thank you guys for checking out today's video. Really do hope you guys enjoy it. If you do, make sure you guys go ahead and smash that like button. Leave some comments down below. And if you're new around here, make sure you subscribe. Turn on notifications because we have new videos every single day. Plus, we started live streaming again, so that's pretty cool. Oh, that guy's going a little faster than I thought he was. <laughs> Alright, so let's jump on to 13, aka Sonora Freeway here. Uh, I think we're going to have to go to the left, which is... What's the name of this one again? I always forget. Oh, shoot. I don't know. We'll figure out once we get there. I think it breaks off. I think 13 goes to the right. Or is this 13 and up there one? I don't know. Alright, we should be seeing them. Um, they should be pulled over. They said they were in the northbound lane, so we are going to have to flip around. Oh yeah, this is a 13, so the other one turns into the 1. All right, you guys see them yet? Oh, there they go. I see them. What the heck? <laughs> you guys see this? What the heck? What is that guy trying to do? Wow, he's wilding out. He really drove that on the highway. He should have known he was going to get pulled over. That's a major DLT violation. Alright, let's head down here and get spent around. I also turn on my lights so I can pop this U-turn. Hey, there goes one of our tow trucks right there. Ace Towing and Recovery. That's who you guys call whenever you guys need a tow, man. Some of these other tow truck operators in San Andreas, they, they be doing reckless stuff like this. Alright guys, we are here. I'm going to turn my lights back on. And uh, yeah, this is looking kind of crazy. Can't believe 
this dude was towing a freaking limo on a flatbed. Now, I have seen some people do this in real life. I don't really know if it's legal or not. I would think it's kind of unsafe because the whole back end is hanging off, you know? So, I, I, I'd say this is pretty unsafe. I wouldn't really do something like this. But yeah, it looks like it's a Silverado 2500 with one, two, three, four, five times two with ten doors. That's a really... Oh, that was close. Move over, guys. Move over, Law. That is really, really an interesting vehicle. I've never seen anything like this before. So a 10-door Silverado limo. Wow. Hello, sir. How are you doing? My name is uh, Ace. I'm here with Ace Towing to recover uh, this blue limo. You guys finished with it? Okay, cool. Um, is does the driver want to take it down himself or do you want me to try to get it down or I go ahead okay All right, so they said I could go ahead and try to get it down that's the uh, driver over here looks like he's getting a ton of tickets for this alright let's uh let's try to put this thing down here this is extremely unsafe though guys alright so I'm gonna go ahead and just roll the bed back here all right time to put this thing down all right that should do it police car because I don't know how far this thing um do you mind moving that first police cruiser for me this thing's gonna need a lot of room for me to get it off the flatbed here okay thank you alright so he's gonna go move that uh, charge out the way for us so that we can put this thing back you always want to keep an eye on traffic too because Unfortunately, a lot of vehicles go off the side of the road. Hey, there goes our service truck, roadside assistance truck. All right, so let's try to unload this thing here. Hope it doesn't hit the other CHP truck there. Yeah, here we go. Okay, perfect. Alright, so I'm going to tow this thing from the rear. That would probably be our best bet here. Um, so I'm going to have to get my truck turned around. And that will just be easier for us. So we don't have to worry about like the transmission getting uh, damaged. And we don't have to worry about pulling it or anything like that. So let's hop into our truck now. Alright guys, so let's put our underreach down. Oh yeah, we're uh, let's lower our arm. Uh, let's line this up. like we get it up let's go ahead and get it tied down cool thing about this truck it actually has some doors that could open up so we'll open up 
this one, and we have our chains, and on the other side we have a little bit more equipment, we have our toolbox and stuff like that over here. I also have a fire extinguisher and an air compressor. So for now, we just need our tie-downs. So let's grab those, and let's get this thing tied down. Now I'm not sure what's wrong with it or why it was being towed. I guess I'm going to have to get that information from the other tow operator. But for now, it's just going to get uh, taken to our yard and we'll just hold it until we figure out what the owner wants to do with it. Okay, perfect. So let's open up this side. We're going to have to grab our wireless light bar. So I'll grab that and we'll just put that on the front. So that's just so that uh, any vehicles following us would know if we're pressing our brake lights or if we're using our turn signals, they will know. And the last thing we just have to do is just put this thing in neutral. And yep, we are good to go. Alright, so that was pretty easy. Let's get the uh, truck back together and let's get out of there. This is another cool feature about this truck to having the uh, controls right here is pretty nice as well. Alright, let's close everything up. Oh. Alright, let's get out of here. All right, sir, we're all, we're all good to go. Thank you. All right, you have a good day, too. Okay. All right, so uh, I'm going to have to pull up. You know what? I may need his help to block traffic for a second. Hey, do you think you could uh, do me a favor and just stop traffic for a second so I could just uh, try to get to the southbound lanes over there? Okay, thank you. All right, so, yeah, he's going to block traffic for us. So that we could get over to the other lanes. All right, so we are getting out of here. Oh shoot! What happened to that deer? This looks pretty cool, towing this thing from the rear like that. That is awesome. This is actually our first time we're towing like a vehicle such as like a limo. So let's uh, probably stop by the service station. We'll spin around in there and then we'll head northbound back to the shop. But hopefully you guys did enjoy though. If you guys enjoyed, you want to see more tow truck videos like this, best way to let me know is by hitting that like button, leave us some comments down below, and don't forget to subscribe, guys. Subscribe. Oh, shit. I was supposed to turn right there. Crap, I missed my turn, but it's okay. We can spin around over here. So we should be back to the shop in probably about two minutes or so.
<laughs> oh, that's interesting of you. <laughs> All right, so I'll get off here in Sandy Shores. This is a nice and easy tow today too, nothing too hard. And we're just able to take care of business. Easy money today guys, easy money. All right, so we're coming back up on the shop. Let's put this in the rear impound lot and we'll be back in service and we'll see if we get any more calls. <laughs> All my workers are just like in the way right now. Alright, so let's back it up. I gotta see what they want us to do with that trailer, dude. That, the semi truck that was hauling it was involved in a uh, accident, but I gotta see if they want us to deliver that semi trailer. All right, we'll leave that right there. Let's go ahead and lower it down. All right, perfect. Let's get all the straps and everything off, and we are good to go, guys. Nice smooth recovery. Let's park this back up into the next call, guys. Into the next call. Alright, guys, so I want to say thank you so much if you made it to the end of the video. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know by leaving a comment. Just say you made it to the end or you watched the whole video or whatever you want to say. Just leave it down below so I can just give you a special shout out for making it all the way to the end. And also, don't forget if you enjoyed, hit the like button. Make sure you subscribe as well. Turn on notifications by hitting the bell. 
Um, that way you'll be notified whenever I upload a new video. So thank you guys so much for watching. Really do hope you guys enjoy. Have a great day, guys, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.